Okay guys, Akumaldo Crypto here and here we have our strong reaction upon touching the 200 standard moving average. Okay, so as many analysts out there have been saying we would either react to it or we would just breach to it and we react. Okay. Uh, however, we have this tentative cross here between the 21 EMA and the 100 EMA. Hmm, this is a bearish cross, pretty much like this one. This one, this was the 21 EMA crossing the 55 EMA. This one is the 21 EMA, the blue one crossing the yellow one. This, this is the 100 EMA. Okay, if we confirm this. Uh, this cross here it's gonna be another sign that we are indeed going deeper that we are indeed in looking for uh, for uh, lower prices but until we get there we need to of course uh, correct this trend line this this huge uh, one two three four one two three uh, I'm calling this the third wave and now we are correcting to our fourth wave okay so this is normal guys and we are about I think the way that I'm measuring it is that we are gonna test 4k region again okay we have uh, we have reached uh, we have uh, we have this what was the price we got to the 30 3900 right so the 4k region is right there is here so as it's common for in in, in any way to count the fourth wave of a, a higher degree in this case this one two three four five it usually goes to the level of the previous one but we are going beyond it so this is the white degree here okay we are now in a region that here is the 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 where I am counting as the first wave if we indeed stop here okay I won't invalidate my count but if we go beyond this level here okay if we start just going beyond I'm gonna need to invalidate this 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 one two three four five this is not a fourth is if this is a fourth wave then we have a, a ending diagonal okay we have a tentative ending diagonal but but going beyond this level here is going to invalidate my count okay i think that we have stopped going up but this is my stop here for this count this is this would invalidate my count okay going not not here but remember we can go above the we can retrace to the region of wave one but only in, in in diagonals okay and in leveraged markets but of course we are in a leveraged market but this is pretty much the level that i'm looking at and this is gonna be my invalidation i'm gonna mark it as my going beyond it going beyond this level invalidates this count okay assuming that we have this a wave here that just retraced everything that it would need to retrace I would expect a b wave going sideways okay because we had a sharp wave here now we are going now I wouldn't be that surprise if we have a, a sideways triangle B here and then a C. If C goes beyond this level here, which I am starting to think that's gonna be impossible, right? We, we need to reconsider this count here. We need to reconsider that what is happening here is not one, two, three. This one here is not a one. Then I would need to reconsider my count and I would be happy to do so because this is. This is the, the market, right? The market is always proving us wrong. We have this target here down. We have the 2400 here, okay? Um, do we have a, 
any chances of finishing the the, 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 the correction here yes 3100 might be the bottom yes indeed why um, let me show you guys uh, where is it it's here I think what is my other explanation it's not here one 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 second guys here's the same thing guys if we go be oh no this is the same short this is remains to be seen I am assuming I want to assume a truncation here for the C wave that's why I need to reconsider this count here unfortunately actually not unfortunately but it goes well with this whole structure here that we are correcting now okay I would just need to reconsider where my third wave starts or whether my third wave is is in it might not be in the third wave might be just beginning uh, it might just be another leg of our third wave yet to be yet to be confirmed but if a is in my count here is yet on the table okay and we have an a b c if we would need to assume truncation i don't like to assume truncation okay and it's it's not advisable when we deal with when we use this framework edit wave it's not ideal to assume tr truncation so and i won't expect it what, I, what is indeed in place is that we are correcting and now we are going to correct in this whole green here. We are going to correct and the, the, the easiest thing to do is just to retrace, to use our retracement tool from the bottom of this wave here to the top. We have five waves. This is, this is uh, hard to not agree upon. And here we have the 50%. If we are to retrace to this 50% and go up, maybe we have we have something else. We have a one, two, three, four, five, uh, a higher, uh, a beginning of a, a new trend. Okay, who knows? It's too soon to call this a, a trend reversal, of course, but we might have a six one eight six five as well. So this is the region, okay. 3300 we're gonna test the 3500 again this is what I am this is what I'm looking for so I'm gonna put this line here so um yes this might be a this might be B this C I'm gonna I'm starting to do to not really like this this count that I'm proposing but nevertheless this is what we have and let me see where I have a different proposal for you guys where is it this one what if guys we have an ending diagonal at the last wave and we have finished this is a 12 hours bit Phoenix okay but what if we have a ending diagonal at the end of this last wave here okay and then we would need to be prepared and change our bias because remember when we get here all the all people were calling bitcoin the the best investment when we hit here last year almost the same time it was december 17 here we were like hitting 19k and we <laughs> people were calling 25k and then we dumped like this like 70 80 percent in value from 19k to 6k what if this whole correction here ended here and now we need to change our bias again even though we have targets going down here even though we have targets go that are pointing to the to the side to the to the downside here what if we are what if we just have a one wave here two three four five what if this is just the beginning of a three four five something like that okay this is a, a silly perhaps proposal but 
I wouldn't, I wouldn't uh, disregard it because this is possible. This is and this is likely because we have we traced enough. Okay, we have we traced enough. So this is one possible, and why not uh, bullish count, an alternate count? It's not my my primary count. I do believe that we still have room to go down. Okay. It all depends on the on this correction that we are in now. We are correcting this trend here. Unless we break this red line here, would be which which would be 6k, then I would call this differently. I would need to reconsider my whole count, and then we would have a different perspective for the future. But bear in mind that we touch the 200 standard moving average and we react to the upside this is a bullish sign on the other hand we have this tentative cross so we have mixed uh signs here we are pretty pretty low in the obv and we have nothing whatsoever here on the macd showing us that we are start to ticking uh upwards above zero here and to start something like this right like it happened here it was less when we had a rally here okay we don't we don't we have a cross here and we don't have nothing here on the macd we have indeed a really pretty low error side this is weekly and a pretty low obv daily is the same thing we are recovering but not by much if we consider that 50 percent below 50 percent is bearish we are still at the daily chart below 50%. Okay, here's the 50%. We are below it. We are not, we're not, if we cross here, if we cross and uh, start going up, start uh, 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 testing the f above 50, per 50, above 50 at the error side, on the error side, so then we might start to reconsider our account here and who knows right i would need to reconsider this this count as well this is a possibility guys this is any diagonal it's not far-fetched at all but what if what about this a wave here it's uh, it's something to, 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 to it's something that i would need to account uh, it's something that i need to take into a into consideration because this a wave just retraced a lot and it's really likely that it this this level here won't hold we are, we, we are really likely that you're gonna have a, after a one two three four five we have an abc so we are gonna have an a b c and then okay this is gonna be an abc Okay, and then we're gonna see another one, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. And then we're gonna resume either going down or going up. Okay, that's the, the that's pretty much summing things up. Okay, we are going either up or down in this case. After finishing this ABC, I, I do believe that we have an ABC here unless we have a pretty strong bullish momentum and break this 6k otherwise we have an abc here okay and we are we are in the same we are in the bear's terrain okay but always be open to reconsider your bias guys if you see the price action showing you uh, something different than you had in that then you had previously in mind so be able and be open to change your mind okay that's what i'm that's what i'm going to do here i'm going to reconsider this thing okay and so i would honestly start shorting here okay this is not going to perhaps one more leg up but okay guys i have been shown i i have been doing those trades with my discord group uh, the Crypto Trader Educational Institute people there are pretty happy 
with not, not only me but other analysts there that have been uh, pretty active and helping each other we we don't we we are not uh, holders of the truth we are always trying to figure out the market together and it's always better to have to have someone else helping us right so join us and if you like my content give me a thumbs up and subscribe and follow me on twitter thanks for watching again and i see you guys next one cheers